It's your boy Rogue Shinner because I am your favorite freedom fighter, your favorite freedom fighter, thugging it everywhere. Don't believe me? Act that bitch think about me. You dig? All right, Gilly, 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 Gilly is all over the blog. Now all of a sudden, yeah, he, he's all he's making fun of uh, Safari. Safari got robbed. You no, know, needs to get robbed every day, B. He'll be all right. I think Safari kind of likes the attention and shit. Like my nigga, you run around with a troll doll with multicolored hair and shit, my nigga. Like, like, come on. And then uh, I guess uh, Ti made a comment on Safari's page talking about it's a cold world. Get a sweater. They're like, motherfucker, didn't you you like plead guilty to a whole bunch of gun charges back in 2008, my nigga? Like, we think you running with the feds, my nigga. You probably making deals wearing wiretaps, my nigga. So like, how you gonna like, my nigga? You you shouldn't even like. Give any type of comments so on niggas filing a police report when he got robbed for his chain. My nigga, like, yo, nigga, need to file his insurance claim in order, in order to file his insurance claim. You have to have that police report. Like, that, that's another whole story that, that seems a little suspect and backwards. But, uh, nigga, Gilly, like, you claim me to be the king of Philly. One, if you're the king of something, niggas don't have to. Niggas acknowledge you as the as the king of something. You don't have to run around saying you're the king of the South or you're the king of Philly. That sounds like some some little fit Ti beef and shit. Like niggas came to clean king of a territory, and niggas when niggas don't niggas don't think of Gilly when you think of Philly. Like especially these commercial niggas. Look when when Drake was beefing with Meek Mills, what he do? He gave a shout out to Ar Ab. Like shout out to Ar Ab. Like. To me, Air Ab is the king of Philly. And I forgot that Air Ab was signed to Lost in the family, Cassidy. So, like, to me, Cassidy's more the king of Philly. But I just finished watching an interview with uh, with the homie Lil Johnny. Lil Johnny interview coming soon. Stay tuned. Live podcast coming back. Revolutionary Cut shows your boy. Be like, yeah. Lil Johnny is now signed to motherfucking Air Ab. And Lil Johnny ain't fucking with this nigga. And if Lil Johnny ain't fucking with him, Air Ab more likely ain't fucking with a nigga you dig. So, like, how the king of Philly and his squad ain't fucking with this nigga, but you fucking with this nigga, but you supposed to be a king of Philly. Like, is there some type of divide going on in Philly? Are you, or is Gilly the Kid gonna go against A.R. Ab? Like, I, I, I was, went back and watched a couple interviews of, of Gilly basically sucking Cassidy nuts, and that, Cassidy like, yo, you don't fuck with nobody but lost any family, nigga. Like, there's a few niggas in, in Philly that I fuck with him because they fuck with him on some street shit, but, like, rapper-wise, they didn't even call Gilly name out. Like, cuz wasn't fucking with you, nigga. Like, Cassie got bars, nigga. Like, only reason why you famous, you used to write from Lil Wayne. But once again, you condone the bullshit for a check. Like, you're a gangster rapper trying to sound pop with little bubblegum jingles and shit, my nigga. Like, that's the reason why you ain't blow. It, it wasn't... Your character didn't match match the lyrics. Like, come on, nigga. Like, I wonder like how real Philly niggas feel about this shit. When how Beans or, or, or Cassie really feel about this situation. Like, come on, nigga. 2018, you you still the the unmost popping nigga in the city, but you the king. I don't get that shit. But I'm not gonna go talk your motherfucking head off. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. Follow my Instagram, Revolutionary Cause, like the Facebook book, like the Facebook fan page, The Revolutionary Cause Show. Until next time, so I want to be a boy. Chibbles.